Hey everybody, Ms. Dietrich here. We're taking a look at question number nine. It says you can buy five t-shirts at Baxter's for the same price that you can buy four t-shirts at Bixby's. If one t-shirt costs $11.80 at Bixby's, how much does one t-shirt cost at Baxter's? So this is an important little nugget right here that they tell us in the word problem. It's the idea that four at Bixby's is the same or equal to five at Baxter's. So we probably need to find out how many if we have, if one t-shirt costs this, right, because it does say that one t-shirt costs this amount, which, by the way, what I have here is equal in value to what I have here. I'm just a fan of shortening up my computation, so I usually eliminate that zero. But we're going to find out how much the four would be. So let's proceed with this algorithm right here. We're going to do eight times four and get the 32. Here we do the four times one, which is four, plus three would be seven, and then four times one would be four, and we have to go over one and go over one. All right, so here's what we know. We know the four t-shirts at Bixby's all together would be $47.20. Now we want to know how much does one t-shirt cost at Baxter's? So if five of them are going to cost $47.20, right, because remember the two values are the same, if five of them are going to cost that, then we need to know what five into $47.20 would be. So that's the next computation that you're going to finish up. You are going to do, let's use a different color so we don't get confused, how about um, blue, we need to find what $47.20 divided by five because remember there's five shirts for that price so once you finish up this calculation then you're going to see one of the choices one of these will be your quotient for this blue algorithm all right good luck finishing that up